The Department of Biotechnology, Government of India launched an ambitious project last year called MANAV to create a comprehensive and integrated map of the human body. The project funded by the DBT and Persistent Systems is undertaken by two institutions in Pune, the National Centre for Cell Science and the Indian Institute of Science, Education and Research. As the project involves uh, collecting a huge amount of scientific data, so the institutions are also training bioscience students uh, to read and extract relevant information from the research papers. The team of Science Monitor attended one such workshop to find out how the students are gaining by being a part of this initiative. The advent of technology has resulted in a large amount of biological data. With millions of research articles having key information on human health and diseases. The data, however, is scattered in different databases, repositories and journal articles. There is a need to collate this information onto a single platform which will be easily accessible to the users like researchers, teachers and students. The MANAV project aims to map the molecular details of the human body. The project also aims to engage students in reading scientific literature, annotating and extracting information from it using the MANAV platform that is in development. Along with upskilling of students across the country, this project will benefit the scientific community. It will be of enormous benefit to the science community. A lot of research which gets into human biology to understand diseases, to understand physiology, pathology, drug discovery. Uh, people talk, people have to work on biology or how the mechanisms are. And what we are trying to put is all those mechanisms together so that it will be a model around which scientists can work and experiment. And we, they might able to get answers in a much easier way as compared to the current. Currently, a platform has been built and is being tested to annotate scientific literature. Extracting scientific information is an intense task and as a part of this project, Students are undergoing the training on how to read and annotate scientific papers. The MANAV project has taken skin as it is the initial point of entry. This will slowly move on to other organs and build a model out of it where we can walk the human body. Mostly my focus was on abstract and result, but this time I had to reach every technique and every uh, culture used, what cell was used for what and the techniques and all, I read them properly, read all of the parts properly. With the necessary efforts, this project will accelerate our understanding of the human body and help design better therapeutic targets for treating various diseases. The MANAV Human Atlas project would thus help in enhancing the networking within the biological community along with the creation of a platform for solving the research problems.